My ways too small, my face too cute, my game too strong, your man too close, he on my phone about these bills. Put mommy on the phone, he ain't never coming on. Look, I'm about to go in, I'ma get inside, he bitch your head like a sewing. I'ma lace the track in the front, make it blend in, pull that shit back so the glue ain't showing. Leo, last zodiac that I am recording for monthly readings, but you're never least, baby. Okay, we're here to talk about your life for the month of February. Any placement of Leo, Sun, Moon, Mercury, Rising, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, North Node, and South Node. Place for anybody who would like to be nosy, they're in here, girl. Okay, check the chart if you want to be sure. So, uh, promo sale specials are back on my monthly readings for a limited uh, time. I'm only going to be in that sale soon. Um, <laughs> you can book a monthly reading for $39.39 if you want personalized messages for yourself in the month of february um all my other pricing and contact information is in the description box down below all the info will be in the pinned comment in the comment section have you liked the video yet while i've been rambling girl have you subscribed if you are already subscribed or have liked the video thank you so much so leo i've already pulled the zodiac signs of who could be around you during this time who could be being nosy who the messages in this reading could be about or pertain to or what zodiac signs can resonate with this reading and i have pulled your overall energy for the month of february of 2024 so the zodiac signs that i pulled was sagittarius scorpio um virgo and then gemini was on the bottom of the uh, deck um these zodiac signs could be around you during this time messages in this reading could be about said zodiacs it, maybe there could be some messages for you in these monthly readings by the way um because sagittarius is a fellow fire sign energy some of y'all could have strong fire in your chart there could be a fellow fire sign around you or messages in this reading could be about a fellow fire sign Overall energy for the month of February is new residence with entrepreneur on the bottom of the deck. Congratulations to any Leo that is in the midst of a relocation, moving, settling into a new home, or some Leos might be thinking about relocating or, or investing into a home, your current living situation during this time. And then you have entrepreneur showing up on the bottom of the deck. So, the first thing that came to mind for me is Leo. Some of you guys might be looking to make certain changes regarding your living situation or um, how you are generating your own income. Like, you know, this kind of reminds me of like somebody here is starting their own business. So they might decide to get a roommate or move back home in order, you know, start saving money, you know, being able to take care of themselves. Um, Somebody here might be looking to whenever it comes to how they make their money or make an income for themselves. They also want that to be in tandem with their living situation. So someone here wants to live close to home. They want to work from home. They, um, yeah, they want to run a business out of their home. Okay. So Leo, we're going to do a spread, pull some deets. Uh oh, girl. Are we live? My ear burning. So, here guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? The Fool. Okay. With the Seven of Cups on the bottom of the deck. Now, the Fool card being your first card out in the reading is pretty major. Okay. Um, the Fool card for me is Miss Store or Mrs. Zentera Sante, but this is uh, also getting out the box, okay? Getting out of your norm, out of your use, your usual routine with the Seven of Cups, definitely. So, Leo, I'm seeing either you need to or are taking a chance on certain, not just desires, but certain, what's it? It's like you're feeding your imagination or your curiosity in regards to certain things. Excuse me, or needing to. I am so sorry. That was disrespectful. Cut that out. Hi, girls. Empress. Hmm. 
you know, the fool card also like the, uh, the textbook definition of the fool card is being on the precipice of a new beginning, like being like right on the edge. Some of y'all are like in that, in that space during this time. Um, seven of cups, ace of swords, three of cups, ace of wands, star, empress, and the knight of cups. A lot of y'all, this is regarding stepping away from your usual type of individuals that you surround yourself with. So you might find yourself being attracted to different types of people romantically or platonically. Is it platonically? Look it up. Is it platonic? Platonic. Okay. Um, yeah, it's, it's like feeling like you're outside of your norm, your normal um, situation in some sort of way. Okay. Ah! Let's just be real. Some fire signs might be experiencing some pain or heartbreak or hurt, um, regarding a certain investment. Uh, it, it, like page of pentacles and a higher fan for me is like, you know, um, I don't know if I want to do business here anymore. I don't know if I want to work for this company anymore. I don't know if I want to have my, my, my account at this bank anymore. Cause, cause a certain situation happens like this for me is like, girl, the one thing that made me drop Geico, like a bad habit is I was living in Nashville. I got into an accident. Um, I had the, the, the shop that was, you know, willing to take care of the damages and pay for the damages, but they was not willing to pay that. What's the shit called the supplement. They was not willing to pay the, um, the auto shop guy, the, the, the supplement because listen, I worked at two car dealerships. All right. One of them was at the collision center. So believe me when I know what the fuck I'm talking about. You don't know how much repair a car needs until you take shit off. So don't expect that, you know, get into an accident. You take your, your shit to an auto shop and just think they're going to be able to tell you what needs to be fixed. They're not going to be able to know exactly until they get all that shit off, until they get all the parts off. And whenever you got the parts off, there was some more internal damage, right? And Geico did not want to pay. Geico did not want to fucking pay. And he had to, I wasn't going to deal with a girl. They was paying for my rental, so y'all figure that shit out, all right? It took a month. It took like a month and some change. And it wasn't like a lot of damage. I needed my seatbelt fixed, airbag, um, and the bumper. And then I think, uh... He ain't even wind up fucking fixing it because I gotta fix whenever I move back to uh move back to Charlotte. The radiator was fucked up. Anyway, but because of that experience, I didn't want to deal with Geico again. Just in case I get into an accident, I don't want to deal with that bullshit again. Okay. Now I know most insurance companies you probably will run into a circumstance or a scenario like that, but nah. Okay, <laughs> I I just didn't like that. And I'm, I'm, I'm really like that. Like whenever I deal with the unpleasant experience regarding something, I don't ever want to do business or deal with that ever again. Okay. And some of y'all see that as the case. You have a, a bad experience with a person, three of cups and a knight of cups, um, a business, higher fence, a job, a career. And now you like fool card, huh? Not here, player. Not here. Okay. I don't I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? Queen of Pentacles, Six of Wands. This is your card. So yeah, some of you guys want to go in a new direction regarding your financial stability, security. How do I say this? Some of you guys were uh, bred to be independent workers, whether it be entrepreneur, um, an independent contractor, someone that possesses a skill or a trade the way they are. They don't need to be in any company, you know, girl, any I, I could get clients on my own. OK, is that sort of situation? Some of y'all were not meant to be a part of the pipeline, the corporate pipeline, six of wands, double emperor and the five of wands. And some of y'all will know that to where you've been in certain situations where you feel like you were challenged for being forthcoming or, you know, sticking to standard. Like you ever been good at your job and other people around you aren't good at their job. 
but you seem to get the most flack. You know, it's like whenever you fuck up on something real minor, they're quick to point it out to you. They're quick to embarrass you, right? But whenever it comes to your peers or your coworkers, these niggas don't do shit and don't get nothing said to them. Okay, if anything, they get a now I need to slap on the wrist. It's like what the fuck is that? Six of Wands and the Devil card. It's because you were. I want to say that. It's like you were meant to do your own thing. Fool card and the Queen of Pentacles. A lot of y'all, like I said, you have a skill, you have a trade, you have a talent. To wear ember. You don't need to be underneath nobody boot. Sorry guys. What's, the, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac. In February of 2024. And some of y'all will experience this. If you feel like you're always getting stuck. With the heavy workload. Um, management is always keeping a close eye on you. But the slackers. The people who really ain't doing shit. Can just get away with not doing shit. Three of wands two of swords and some of y'all are trying to figure out okay over these next couple of weeks and months because the three of wands for me is a little bit longer of a time than two of wands over these next weeks and months food car what changes do i want to make to my stability financially okay do i want to move do i want to relocate do i want to switch jobs do i want to switch careers do i want to start a business do i want to start my own venture it's too much <laughs> I'm tired. See, guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? It's just so much to think about. Oh, that's why. Death, girl, why? Girl, I sound like them fucking rock, rock music videos. Why? Death. Now, yes, yes, yes. Whenever you're shedding Leo, you will find yourself having to switch lanes whenever you are shedding your old self you won't be able to stay in the same circumstances predicaments and environments you're going to be itching for a change and you won't be able to tolerate certain things anymore you're going to want to be set free from it okay hi man king of wands oh god man i'm gonna be honest I'm going to whisper because I don't want to buy in your business. Some Leo men, something missing from your life. Five of Cups, Ace of Cups, and the Page of Wands. It's either emotionally. Do you need you a good woman or man? Whatever your steez is. Something's missing from your life. It's either emotionally or passion. You know? Five of Cups is here. It's like there's a void that you need to fill. There's a void that you might need to fill. You'll 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 uh, be able to realize this if you find yourself entertaining people that you don't really even fuck with. Um, you're doing things that you know are no bueno for you. Others, girl, why why are you here? Why are you still dealing with this? Some of y'all, there is a water fellow fire sign or an earth sign individual. Let it go. L-I-G it, Reggie. Let it go. Is there a Reggie in here? Let it go. Okay. It's like with the page of wands, you might still be looking for something from someone or a certain connection that's not there. World, it's done. It's over with. Close the book. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? Or if it's not other people, Page of Wands and the King of Wands could be a self thing. You know, it, it's like um, there's some things you need to deal with <laughs> internally rather than, you know, taking it out on like what's a whether it be a woman or a man. When a woman or a man is bitter, they show it. They show it in how they react to certain situations, certain people that trigger them. Okay, um, it's like not everybody was your ain't shit ass boyfriend, current or ex. Okay, uh, not everybody is that ain't shit ass bitch that you dealt with and she took thirty dollars from you, she stole from you. Now you believe all bitches ain't shit. No, that bitch you was fucking with wasn't shit. Okay, don't put it on all of us, right? Or the, the bitches, not 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 the women. Okay, that's all the situation. Okay, the lovers with the Knight of Pentacles. Choices, 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 Leo. Yeah, girl, like it's gonna be a slow exit. God damn. Huh. 
Hi, girls. Queen of Wands. Now, Leo, some of you guys need to or have made the decision to leave something completely behind. And it's like, even though you stepped out on faith and detaching from your norm, you're still figuring things out. Knight of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, Queen of Wands, and the Six of Cups. And it's very hard for you not to turn back or look back. And you shouldn't, okay? It's like what they say. There's no there's no pamphlet or book to being a parent, okay? Oh, oh. Am, I, <laughs> am I talking to the mothers and the fathers? Okay, girl, I don't know how much I got to uh, give because I'm not one of them. Okay, but it's like that to where they say there's no, you know, how to do book on being a parent. There's no how to do book on being an adult. You just got to figure it out. Okay, unfortunately, they not going to teach us that in schools. Because then we'd be smart anyway. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? You want to explain to me what that is? Yes. It's a thief. Seven of swords with the strength. Now, this is your energy. Now, Leo. Do not stay or go back to a connection that with the death card, L-I-G it. L-I-G it. If with the three of wands, you don't see it going nowhere, Hell, I G it, okay? Rather than seven of swords. Letting somebody take advantage of you or you entertaining a certain situation with the seven of swords. It's like, come on, what are we really doing here, okay? But with the strength card and the page of cups, you got to be willing to be like, I don't want to say your emotions don't matter, but it's like, <laughs> I'm going to say it. Fuck it. How I feel about the situation don't matter. What's the facts? Let's look at things from a logical and rational standpoint. What is it time for me to let go of? Step away from? Like I said, some of you guys have already been doing that with the three of wands. You've only been focused about what you're going towards. Be careful. Because with the seven of swords, you might be prone to kind of... <sighs> self-sabotage food card and the seven of swords seven of swords it's like you know what you need to do but you kind of don't do it um it could be due to fear you know being scared about what uh what all you're gonna have to deal with um it could be due to i want to do whatever the fuck i want to do right um no discipline So, guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? Oh, God. Three of Cups. I say that because the Seven of Swords and the Lovers card is out here. You know this don't look good. Leo. Let me talk to the Leos that did the right thing. Leo, some of you guys did the right thing in separating from a water, air, or earth sign individual. This was a friend or romantic relationship. If it was a friend, you did the right thing because maybe you did see it and that's why you was like, nah, bitch, not around me. Okay? Maybe you did see it and you decided to let somebody go. But some of y'all had a friend that was not your friend. Or you maintained a friendship with some, yeah. Yeah, you maintained a friendship with somebody who didn't really like you. Or who was using you. Three of Wands and the Seven of Swords. It's like someone that only comes around whenever things look on the up for you. Whenever you look like you're doing well in life. Then they want to get close to you. But whenever you're kind of like going through it or things are a little rough from you. Oh, no. Don't want to deal with the bitch. Okay. Oh, okay. You know. Oh, girl. Oh, man. Girl, we got to rumble. Um, This for me is having a friend that do you dirty. Whether it be they steal from you or they fuck your man. I personally have never had that, but I was friends with somebody that did that to a mutual friend of ours. It wasn't her man, but it was her ex. And that was still like, what the fuck is wrong with you? I should have known. Luckily, because she got cut. She, <laughs> she got cut for other reasons, but I should have known then. It's, it's very telling. 1919 confirmation. Whenever you see people be dirty to other people, please believe it. 
Believe it, girl. It's going to be you soon, okay? And some of y'all third-party situation, okay? Cheating ass nigga. <laughs> cheating ass dude, cheating ass bitch. Whichever way it go, okay? Uh, some of y'all case with a water, a uh, fellow fire sign. Let me call it the ah, let me call it the signs. Aries, Virgo, Scorpio, Gemini, Aquarius, Cancer. I already said Aquarius. Are you if this is in regards to a thruple situation, some of y'all need to stop dealing with somebody who just want to keep you on the shelf. Like, whenever they feel like playing with you, they'll take you off the shelf. But if they don't, they're going to put you back on there and then go to their next uh, toy. I hate to be that harsh with you, okay? I don't like that. Or someone here strictly didn't want to deal with you because you was not going to be an option. It's like they still wanted the time to play around and sort out all their options. And you was like, bitch, it's, it's, do they not know who I am? It's the big Don. Like, are you kidding me? You want me to stand here and wait for to be picked? You out your fucking mind, okay? Food card, queen of pentacles, and the three of wands. I don't get picked, I pick, okay? There's somebody who couldn't have that. They <laughs> They could not have that, okay? Now, I'm going to go with the bitch or the dude who is desperate for me, okay? <laughs> oh, wow. I ain't going to get in here, okay? It ain't like that situation doing good. Let me just say that. Spirit, guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? Yeah, what goes around, come back around. It's like somebody here that do you dirty, get done dirty, whatever. Ten of Wands. Goodness gracious. I said it earlier, girl. We're tired. All right. Thank God some of you guys have a great support system. I feel like a lot of y'all might be going through a lot, but you got people around you that, you know, are supportive. Okay? It's like you got people around you that make the load less heavier. Whether it be friends, being in a relationship. And I'm seeing some Leos have squandered that. Three of Wands, Seven of Swords, and the Lovers. That's what happens when you do people dirty. Now you ain't got nobody around you. Okay? Mm -mm. Last card. Spirit guys, what's happening to the Leo Zodiac in February of 2024? Or your reputation will precede you. Whenever you've been a dirty bitch or you've done trifling things to multiple people, it's going to get around, okay? Three of Pentacles. See, it's that third party shit. I don't fuck with it. I don't know what it is, Leo, that you need to handle, but you need to handle it. You're not going to be able to get rid of something just by ignoring it, okay? Temperance. I forgot who I told this to. It might have been Virgo. Uh, needing to handle certain things. It's like, don't try to backdoor your way out of something. Don't try to shortcut your way out of it because it's going to bite you in the ass. It's going to come back around you. Some of y'all handle things as, as, as need be. Does that make sense? Okay. Mm-hmm. Temperance, hangman, queen of wands, eight of cups. It's like, rather than you dragging around some baggage, go ahead and drop the shit off. Okay. There's certain things that, Leo, I feel like you, you need to handle. You need to address. You need to take care of. You know what it is. Leo, some people won't want to deal with you because you're too difficult. <laughs> now, in some cases, it could be, you know, you know what? It kind of reminds me of the whole Monique situation that we're seeing right now between her and Tyler Perry to where Tyler had fucking lied. 
seven of swords and said that she was a difficult person to work with just because he didn't like the fact that she she wanted what she didn't want to um, do the press do the international press for uh precious without being paid and he didn't want to pay her okay it's like certain people will go as far to lie on you Whenever Queen of Pentacles, lovers, and the Ten of Wands, they not you not finna just be treated any sort of way. Oh no, I done had that happen to me at work. That's how I got fired from one of my jobs, the dealership. I was dealing with, girl, I'm gonna say it, some sexual harassment. I was dealing with some sexual harassment because I worked in the collision center, so it was all men. I was the only woman down there, and I brought it to HR. Worst decision I could have made because then I became a target of the fucking owner. It used to be Felix about this. Um, for Lincoln, I'm telling you, I don't give a fuck about that place. Felix about is now it's Mark Ficken. Mark Ficken was the GM at the time. He bought the dealership. Um, but I had to have a conversation with that man. Fuck Mark Ficken. They moved me to another department once I had made it known what I was dealing with. They had just brought some new bitch in to do my job, and then I was I was a file clerk. I went from being an admin assistant in the collision center to just putting away fucking papers. Bitch, I got how I fell asleep, and they fired me. Okay, they got me the fuck up out of there. Fuck them. I got this. this fuck them. Fuck them. I walked away with a little bit of money. They tried to offer me a severance package before they did that bullshit to me, so I already knew it was coming. Fuck y'all. But it's like that. Whenever you are someone that won't be moved... Oh, no, we got to make you the villain now. Ah, uh, don't do that. I, I ran over. Leo, this was your February monthly reading. Check the chart, baby.